Sunday, January 15th, 2023, 9.30 a.m. There were 72 people on board, of which 68 were passengers and four were crew members. the aircraft being operated on the route. An ATR-72 flown by Yeti Airlines. The plane was under the command of Senior Captain Kamal KC, Anju Kadawada as co-pilot. Kadawada's husband, Deepak Pokrol, who also worked for Yeti Airlines, died in the 2006. ATR-72-212 was operating scheduled flights between Kathmandu and Pakra International Airport at 10.33 a.m. The aircraft was a 15-year-old twin-engine turboprop. It was first delivered to Kingfisher Airlines in 2007. In 2013, it was transferred to Knock Air as HSDRD before being delivered to Yeti Airlines in 2019. The takeoff, climb, cruise and descent to Pakra was normal. During the first contact with Pakra Tower, the ATC assigned the runway 30 to land. but during the later phases of flight crew requested and received clearance from ATC to land on runway 12. At 10.51 a.m. The aircraft descended towards Pokhara Airport and joined the downwind track for runway 12 to the north of the runway.
At 10.56 a.m., the pilots extended the flaps to the 15 degrees position and selected the landing gears. Lever to the down position. The takeoff setting was selected on power management panel of 721 feet above ground level. The PF then called for flaps 30. And the PM replied, flaps 30 in descending. Propeller rotation speed and of both engines decreased simultaneously to less than 25% and the torque started decreasing to 0%, which is consistent with both propellers going into the feathered condition. During that time, of both engines were at 0%. They are not producing thrust. killing all 72 occupants on board. It is the deadliest accident involving an ATR-72.